Hi, everyone. My name is Michael Hawkins. I'm part of the sales engineering group here at BCM1. And today I'm going to be doing a quick demo on our UCAS1 BCM1 hosted voice platform. Now, before we get started, I want to kind of describe the brains behind um, our systems or our infrastructure that we use to power this solution. We've got, we are a Cisco WebEx and Cisco Broadsoft shop. We have each of these platforms available in geo-redundant data centers located throughout the country. We do semi-annual uh, disaster recovery testing to ensure that all of our protocols work should, that it, should one of our nodes experience a catastrophic issue. And we also do capacity or engineering planning uh, to make sure that any one of our single nodes can carry the entire load of all user traffic across our whole environment should there be multiple failures. Um, so with that said, and now that you have a little bit of an understanding of backend infrastructure, let's take a look at some of the parts that BCM has made uh, extremely custom and easy to use uh, for your clients or, or end users. So I'll go ahead and log in. You log in with your phone number at UCAS BCM1 um, and a password. This screen is a front end wrapper that we've created to essentially give you all of the most commonly used tools or functions that we find people ask for in an easy to find or single location. So if I need to forward calls, I can very simply just slide that little button right there and all my calls have been forwarded over to my voicemail. If I want to see just approximately, and keep in mind this is a demo account, how many calls that I've placed this week or last week, um, or even a custom uh, search parameter, I can do all those things directly from in here. I can also reset my password, or if I'm looking for a specific feature, this is one of my favorite parts of the software, is it gives me the ability to start typing and it narrows down what those results are, what I'm searching for. So in this case, I showed you before, we can either slide that little button that forwards all my information, or if I can't remember where that button is, I can always come in here and do it directly from here. So now that we've gone over some of the user administration points of the BCM1 UCAS hosted voice platform, um, let's take a look at the endpoints. Now in this particular case, I'm gonna be demonstrating the Cisco WebEx endpoint or soft phone that's installable on both PCs and Macs, but we also offer the ability to integrate our systems very tightly with the Microsoft Teams environment using the voice enabled Teams. Um, but for the purposes of this discussion, we'll go over the WebEx. As you can see over here on the left hand side, I have several icons that I can look at. This is a very feature rich, full fledged communication system. I can do texts, I can do uh, instant messaging, I can do rich media content, um, and I'll show you what I mean by that. So this is my one-on-one -on -one information or just chatting back and forth with people. That's pretty self-explanatory. I can also create some kind of cool organized teams to where I can take a look and put people inside of a group and have just open discussions with anyone. Like I'd mentioned before, this is a rich media format, so I can paste stuff directly into it and pull it down right from that same IM conversation. It makes finding things very easy uh, as far as, and accessible from multiple locations. If you have a bunch of contacts that you would like or that you frequently contact or are in communications with, um, you can put those in your top contacts or other contacts or teams and start either IMs, audio calls, or voice calls directly from that interface. Now, there's not a whole lot to this button, but essentially it's your dial pad, and it gives you the ability to either click on this with a mouse, type in digits directly from your keyboard, or spin up a call right from the left-hand side on one of the people who you've recently been in contact with. Over here, I have my voicemail messages, and that's... That's nice, but my favorite feature of this service is that it actually takes any voicemail messages that you have, transcribes them, and sends it to you via email. So in the copy of that email, you get the transcript of the text that you can easily read through, as well as the WAV file, um, just for reference. And then lastly, this gives us the, this last one gives us the ability to either spin up an ad hoc meeting using my personal room link, or to schedule a meeting and meet with other people later. 
I can do both of those directly from this platform. Um, but I think one of the other neat features that the BCM that the BCM UCAS one offering has is the ability to pretty much be able to perform any action that you would perform on the desktop from your mobile application. So let's take a quick look at that. So I'll go ahead and open up my WebEx client. And as you can see, most of the stuff has a very familiar format to the, uh, to the last piece of software we were just looking at. The main difference being our icons, instead of being on the side, are down on the bottom. But all the functionality is maintained. So all the same direct communications that I had from an instant messaging perspective are available. I can go into my Teams, and just like I was showing before, that rich media experience is available to me rather I'm on a mobile phone. I can pull that information directly right from here, just as easily as I can on my desktop. All my contacts are maintained, the same groups, the same people. My calling is very similar, except for it gives me two options. I can either pull a call in that someone's got on hold, or I can just pull up my dial pad and dial from here. When I use this application to dial outbound, it makes sure that my outgoing number is my business number and not my personal cell phone, which is also a great feature. And then lastly, and I think one of the most powerful ones, if you're on the go a lot and you have a bunch of meetings, you can very efficiently administer a WebEx meeting directly from your cell phone. So I just started the meeting and I'll wait for that to connect. Oh. And inside of here, you can very quickly see that there are a bunch of different options. I can share content. So I can do that directly from uh, images on my phone. I can do it from an application such as Microsoft OneDrive, or I can even do a whiteboard, which allows us to give visual interpretations of whatever we're talking about very easily. And again, all from my cell phone. Um, I can also do polls. I can show statistics. And I think this is kind of interesting. If I'm doing an audio or a video call, I can judge the quality of the network to understand what was going on if there was a problem and use that uh, it have that actionable information to help troubleshoot. So that is our BCM1 hosted voice platform UCAS demo. Um, if you guys have any other questions, we're happy to dive into that. And there's a lot of interesting information that we have available from the administration side as well. Please feel free to reach out.